Hey, Tracy's Place fam. I hope everyone is doing well. I am back with a spring video. I think we're in spring. Sometimes I think we are, I think we're not, but the weather's changing here and there. It's cold here, it's warm there. Today here, it was like in the 60s, but then it's gonna snow in a couple of days. So anyway, we still need to get ready for spring. So I wanna show you all some of my favorites nail and lip color for the spring but see all the pretty colors a couple of them i had already and some of them i just picked up the other day on my haul and i was out to the store so i picked up some more getting ready, getting ready for spring all the pretty colors so i'm going to show you all what i have and maybe give you all some suggestions if you all are about to start you know going out picking spring outfits and accessories and things to go with them. Don't forget about your nail and lip color. Mm -hmm. So I went to several different places to get, you know, these things. Like I said, a couple, couple of them I had already, a couple of them I just picked up. Um, and I'll tell you the brands that I have. And that would be Broadway. I have Sally Henson. I have LA Colors. LA Colors and Wet n Wild, Revlon, and OPI. So those are, yeah, those are all the ones that I have. And then the lip colors, a couple of them came from the hair store and what we call the wig store. And a couple of them came from the Dollar Tree. So I'm gonna get on into it. I'm gonna show you all the pretty colors and different things like that. Uh, I'm gonna start with Broadway. Broadway, I pick up from the Dollar General and they are just $1. So this is a very, very pretty color for spring. It's called Wild Orchid. It's like a fuchsia color. It is so pretty. So that's Broadway and the color is Wild Orchid. Like I said, and I'm trying to pick out the neck, the uh, lip color that goes with it. It doesn't go with it. I didn't buy it together, but this is more like a fuchsia. And this is, this is fuchsia. This is called fuchsia. So this I picked up, this is the lip color. I picked it up from the wig store and that is so pretty. It goes nicely with that. But this also you can wear with that. This is um, NK lipstick from the hair store and it's called Barbie Pink. And it is so pretty too. So that's the Barbie Pink and it's from NK Makeup. And this is the Broadway in Wild Orchid. So those are very, very pretty. I used to wear a fuchsia boldly back in the day. I sure did. I love me some fuchsia lipstick. Um, Wet n Wild. It's called Pink Ice. And that is so pretty. Let me see if I can find one that it will go with pretty good. And that is this LA Colors. I picked this up from the Dollar Tree. This is First Date. So that's First Date. It's real pretty. has a really pretty sheen on it. And then this is from Wet n Wild from the Dollar Tree. So this was a dollar from the Dollar Tree. This was a dollar from the Dollar Tree. Pretty colors, gorgeous. So Wet n Wild to me is a good product. Now, I know people favor their Macs and um, Maybellines and different things like that, more ex on the high end. I'm not, a, I won't say I'm not a big fan of it. I just, I don't wear lipstick like that to where I pay a lot of money for my lipsticks. I like for my lips to, you know, look nice, of course. Um, but for me, these last really good LA Colors. I used to think it was such a cheap brand. And then when I started wearing it, I found out oh, it's, it's a good brand. It's, it's really good. Um, so, yeah, don't, don't skip out on it. So that was... Uh, I had Broadway and LA Colors. This is a Broadway Quick Dry. And that's very pretty. It's like a corally pink color. And it is called Summer Breeze. And that is the quick. I love the color. Now, I have tried these Quick Dries before. And it did not last super long. 
It did not last as long as the other ones, even with my um, Insta-Dry. And this keeps everything on. So I was kind of leery about getting a lot of these, but I said, I'm going to try it one more time because this it was a different color and everything that I got. And I was like, that don't make any sense. All my other ones last. And this really makes them last. This uh, Sally Henson Quick Dry, Insta-Dry. And I said, I don't, that was strange. So I said, let me give it one more try. So I bought another one in a different color. So this one is Summer Breeze. So I'll try to remember to let y'all know how I like it. Okay, so that was a dollar from Dollar General. So Broadway is from Dollar General. I got another Broadway here, a Summer Bikini. And it's just so odd because all the other Broadways, I get Broadway all the time because Broadway lasts a long time. And um, I rival it up to any high end any day. And my, my manicures stay good a long time. But this is Broadway and it is called Summer Bikini. And it is so pretty. Hope you all can see that. And then I have another Broadway. It is called Ballet Flat. So remember all the Broadways, they are $1. That's very pretty. That's like a light pink. So very pretty. Okay, this is this. Now, I'm not really a neon person and it's not super neon, but it's 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 all right. I bought it just for a pop of color, like if I have on something, I don't know, that it would go with. I just thought it was kind of pretty, so I bought it. So I have to try it out, and I'll try to let y'all know when I have it on, like in a video or something. But this is Jenny's Pout. It is like a hot pink. This is a fuchsia, and this is like a hot pink. So, yes. So this is brighter. The hot pink is like brighter. But like I said, it's called Jenny's Pout. And... Moving on to, oh my goodness, this is so pretty, y'all. This is LA Colors from Dollar Tree. And let me see, the color is Vertigo. And, and it's it is so pretty. It's like a lilac-ish with a little bit of like that stone, um, concrete-ish gray or whatever. But it has the lilac, pretty lilac color. It is so pretty on. Very pretty. Uh, let's see here. I got the the LA Colors base coat and top coat, it says. I've never tried it, so this will be my first time. But I just picked that up the other day. And let's see here. This one I'm excited to try. This is a little different than this one. I know it looks similar, but it has a different off cast in person. And this is from the Dollar Tree. It's LA Colors First Date. Cute name. And it's a very pretty pink. Okay. And sometimes, you know, I know people don't like certain brands and they think something's cheap and they won't get it because it costs or doesn't cost a lot. And, you know, people have all different kinds of methods to, you know, their style and fashion and stuff like that. But don't skip on it, y'all. If, if you don't have to. And sometimes people can't afford certain brands too. go to Dollar Tree, you all. They have good brands there. Um, and like I said, Dollar General and other places, a lot of times it just depends on what you put with it. If you got a good base coat and you have a good Insta Dry, good top coat, you will be good to go. I have been anyway, so I have to speak from my experience. Okay, this I usually don't wear, um, but this was so cute. I thought this was a cute with blue jeans, um, uh, pretty pastel blues in the spring so anyway this is from la colors and it is called ocean view and that is so pretty it's a pretty blue so i'm gonna i'm gonna venture out and do a little 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 much with my colors okay this no i'm not gonna go to opi yet okay we're gonna stick with la colors this is aloha vibes that's like a peachy pink like a peachy pink um it is very pretty it's number 216 okay my um next one is la colors this one oh my goodness this is pretty greek isles that is gorgeous it's like a jade color greenish blue kind of look like tropical waters but it's so pretty and that was greek isles from la colors from the dollar tree very pretty 
and this one is so pretty too um this one you okay this one y'all know i'm a mixologist y'all know i was chemic a, a chemist in my other not i don't believe in other lives i always joke about that but i don't believe in that but i was, I was a chemist or something i just be mixing up and doing stuff y'all but um it's called batch i'm sorry not batch it's called tropical breeze but this is not what it looked like i think this was like a grayish um lavender and i mixed it with it was very light and i mixed it with this wet and wild on voyage i did it like last year and it came out so pretty i would take it out for y'all because it's actually a little deeper than what it appears but i don't want to drip it on the carpet or anything i don't want to take it out the you know take the brush out but it is so pretty but and sometimes if you can't find exactly what you want mix the polishes mix your colors um y'all go back to red and blue mix green and what red and blue mix purple go back look at your little charts from elementary school and stuff because this was a like a rusty orange and I put some, I've always worn, I could not find the right color that I want. I had something in my mind, but I could not find it in any brand. I wanted a reddish brown. And this was like a rust. And I ended up putting um, a, a brown nail polish in here. And I don't think I put red in it, but the rust kind of brought out a little bit of the red somehow. I don't know, but this is like a, a reddish brown. When you put it on, and it is so gorgeous on. I love this. But I got this in the fall. But this was from Revlon, from Dollar Tree. $1, and it's good polish. Very good polish. Okay, so that's that. This one. I just picked this up from Revlon, from the Dollar Tree. It is called, oh my goodness, All Greased Out. And it's G-R-E-I-G-E-D. Gredged out, all gredged out or something. Number 462. This is like a stone with just a hint of lilac. And that is very pretty. So I just picked that up. Um, I'll probably wear that with some muted colors or whatever. But it was, it was pretty. Um, and let's see. Let's go to OPI. I do not like this matte white nail polish like... Some y'all excuse me. It's, I think more of the younger girls are wearing it, but I can't stand it. My daughter wears it all the time. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like it. I want a uh, frosted white. Uh, I, I just don't. I don't like matte colors. I don't like. I, don't, I think I said mute before, but matte. It's a matte white. Ooh, I do not like that. Ooh, I, I can't stand it, y'all. But I wanted a frosted white. This is not white. White. It's kind of an off white, but it is so pretty and it has a, a sheen to it. Uh, it's called Snow Glad to Meet You. I'm sorry, Snow Glad I Met You, and it is so pretty. I really like that. I really like that. And she, <laughs> my daughter knows I don't like it, but she loves it. So she going to wear what she loves. And I'd be like, ooh, she'd be like, mama. <laughs> okay, this is another OPI. And this OPI, y'all, I got from, we have a Sally, Hint, I'm sorry, not a Sally, a Sally's Beauty Supply. Sally's. And it went to being a clearance um, outlet, Sally's. So the OPIs, everything in there is cheap i got these opis like 2.99 3.99 and you know y'all know they cost way more than that um so i got this machu picchu opi it's like a, a oh a very muted pinkish taupe color and so that's that's not matte doesn't look matte it has a little sheen to it but i don't i do not like those matte ones y'all okay this is what i have on right now and to me, it's kind of in between spring and, and uh, you know, winter. It's like a, looks like a poppy seed to me. But anyway, it's called Cajun Shrimp. And it's from OPI. I got it from Sally's, our outlet, or clearance Sally's. It's pretty. Um, I probably won't have it on. It's not my favorite favorite. I think it's cute, but it's not my favorite. It's not one of my favorites. So anyway, uh, I have another OPI. 
natural nail. This is a base coat. I was in need of a base coat. So I got this one and then I got this base coat. And this also can be a top coat from LA Colors. I showed y'all that one already. This is OPI. And I think that's it as far as the nail polishes. So, and you all know I use this top coat. It's an Insta-Dry top coat. It's from Sally Hansen. I got it from Kroger's, but you can pick it up from Walmart, um, Walgreens, CVS, just about any drugstore. And if you have a big market, you know, grocery store in your makeup area, it will probably be there. So that works wonders, you all. This is my favorite along with Seche V or Seche Vite. And you can get that at Sally's too. I think it costs like $7.99 or something. It is awesome. It is awesome. But this is cheaper at like $4.99. All right, and then here we're going to go to the, okay, this is what I have on now, this lipstick. It's called Natural Shine. It's from LA Colors, got it from Dollar Tree. It is a, like a nude. So I have it on now, but I have it on with a lip gloss. I have mine on with a lip gloss, but it's very pretty. It almost looks pinkish or by the time I put it on, I think it looks a little mauvish, nudish. But I have, so I have that on with, ooh, which one did I put on with it? One of these lip glosses, y'all. I can't remember which one I used. I think it was uh, Just Kissed. I think I put on Just Kissed with it. And then I used like a brownish, a brown lip liner around my lips just to line them, define them a little bit. So anyway, this is, like I said, Just Kissed. I love this one. You can put it on by itself and it's just... You know, you're running out and you just want something on. Keep your lips moisturized. Just a little tint. Just kissed from LA Colors from the Dollar Tree. And uh, and they both say moisturizing formula. They are so pretty. Uh, this one is Happiness from LA Colors from the Dollar Tree. So I don't know if I move them a little bit if you can see the shimmer. They're just a little bit different in color. And I like them both. This one, you can also get a duo. It's called a Lip Duo, LA Colors Lip Duo from um, Dollar Tree. And what better? Two for one. You have a lipstick and a gloss. So it's called Twinkle. Um, the combination is called Twinkle. So it's not two different colors. It's a lip gloss and a lipstick. And the whole set is called Twinkle. This looks like a corally peach to me out on the bottom and then up top it's kind of like it's like coral very pretty very pretty i haven't tried it yet this is new out of the package so that is very pretty okay and this is the last one this is coral crush and this is very pretty. I have not tried this yet either. Just LA Colors from the Dollar Tree Coral Crush. All right, so I hope y'all enjoyed that. And if you want to pick up something cute for your lips and nails, you know where to go. Dollar Tree, Dollar General, um, Walmart, where else? I think that's that's about it. You do not have to pay a lot for it if you, if you choose not to. And if you're just in the market to where you're, uh, what's that thing going on? Bougie on a budget? You want to be bougie on a budget? Cute on a budget? Just just go to your um, what do you call it? discount stores. It is okay, ladies. It's okay. <laughs> now, unless you're into... Now, I don't know about the all the ingredients in here. I have to study those. I haven't done that yet. I know some people like uh, what cruelty-free products and different things like that. So, I have not studied all this. So, if you're concerned about it, do your research. And if you're just wanting to, you know, look cute a little bit on the cheap, here you go. All right. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, y'all go and get y'all some cute outfits and some little lip color and nail polish and be cute. All right. Oh, and I almost forgot. LA Colors has a very nice auto eyeliner. Uh, you can get it in black. And I think they have two other colors too. But yeah, they have that in black. And that's what it looks like. And this one has done very, very well for me. And you get that from the Dollar Tree. All right. Love you all. Be blessed. And I will see you guys next time right back here on Tracy's Place. All right. Bye.